GBH TV is brought to you by Grand Blank CTE. Hi, welcome to GBH TV. Located in a cell service at Zone 718B, we bring students of Grand Blank high quality announcements every day. To achieve our quality, we use the latest and greatest technologies professional cameras, state of the art green screens, and motion stabilizers. Looks like the crew made a fresh announcement. Let's check it out. What's up, Grand Blank? Just want to put it out there that any current freshmen or sophomores looking to learn more about AP Capstone can join the Google Classroom using this code right here to get more info. Other than that, now on over to your next ad. Are you a senior receiving special education services? There are many jobs for you after high school, waging $10 to $20 an hour. See Mrs. Tate for more information. So everyone, welcome back to Economics. My name is Pat Moore, and I'm just here to give you the just and the breakdown of this graph right here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go down to the demand, down to supply, go over, make sure the supply cost is always equal, make your little triangle right here, look at that, that's a beautiful triangle, shade it in so everyone in the class knows, hey, that's a triangle. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, another triangle, square. And that is economics, baby. Mr. Moore, I think I got a question. Question. Now on to the next question. All right, so what we're going to move on now to is elasticity. So the elasticity of a car goes down, but guess what? The price always rises up. But guess what? Guess what? There's more triangles, baby. More triangles, a lot more shading. But guess what? Guess what? Even more. What? Got a little more. Got a little more down here. Look at that. Look at that. I'm like Bob Ross over here. If you are interested in taking AP Macro or Micro, Mr. Moore wants nothing from you except your effort. So for all you econ gurus out there, we want you in room 605 for AP Econ. Hi, um, where are the AP Psychology application forms? Uh, honey, you can get those at East yeah. Campus or room 103. Oh, thank you. Sophomores and juniors, are you interested in taking AP Psych next year? Please pick up an application outside of room 103 or in the counseling office at East. They're due to Miss Reich on March 1st. Any students interested in taking AP government, please grab an application from room 624D at West Campus and the counseling office or your U.S. history teacher. I'm your broadcasting teacher. Well, see Mr. Reich or the email down below if you have any questions. If you are interested in AP Human Geography, go to room 409. The applications are due March 4th. There are a lot of ways to talk about zest and enthusiasm, and since I am sitting in front of the camera, that means I might know a few things about it. The first thing that I usually do to start my day off with a little bit of zest and enthusiasm is I like to send people good morning texts or just say good morning to anyone I see in the hallway. It's just a really nice way to start off the day and you get to spread a little bit of positivity and joy and it makes people smile. I've never really encountered anyone that didn't like it when I said good morning and if they ever did, I, it doesn't really matter. To me, zest and enthusiasm means getting up and being excited about the day before you know what's gonna happen throughout the day. Walking around with a positive mindset and being excited about your life. Enthusiasm is having a passion for something. And whenever you're working on like a project, it doesn't ever feel like work, it just feels like you're having fun every second of the day. Always keep your head up and you can never look down on things. And that's what I do is I look at the bright side of things and never look down. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.